Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from Spirit and for all of us who are all on this journey to love and to reunite with our divine vibrational matches in this lifetime. And so this is the day after Valentine's Day, and we've had like crazy storm weather in the UK. So um, I have had intermittent, not very good cut off internet access. Hence, I haven't been able to get back to anyone <clears throat> or do any videos. But seems that this morning it is back on again. So um, happy day after Valentine's Day. I'm glad that we all survived it. <laughs> so um, I hope that you managed to get through okay. Valentine's Day is always a bit of a tricky day. But um, as usual, probably we all got so many signs from spirit. Um, so, but we're through another year. <laughs> so well done. So the message is today, it is um, from the spirit animal and also from native spirit that recently it's been very much native energy that has wanted to be supporting us and spirit animals. So it is the whale spirit, trust in the great mystery. That's interesting because we had the great mystery the other day from here and grandmother. Ooh, so grandmother energy has been super strong recently as well. <clears throat> and interestingly, I was having, um, you know, just beautiful how spirit works. I'd asked for a rose um, for, you know, from basically spirit from um, Valentine's Day from my twin. And then who booked into my B&B but a lady named Rose. <laughs> so you never know how it's going to come, but it is going to come. And uh, that's the beauty. It's about seeing how the spirit and the universe and your twin spirit um, always delivers. But it may not be, well, it most never is in the way that I expect. It's always in um, a different way, but it always comes no matter what. So whale spirit. Whale spirit is an ancient creature who was here at the beginning of time and who has seen everything, felt everything and heard everything that has ever transpired on this planet. In the hidden realms where all things must gather first before manifesting into form, whale spirit is the keeper, singing the soul of the whole world from the deepest... Oh, I love that. This is so in line with the conversation that I was having yesterday. Um, <clears throat> from the deepest... Um, waters of the coldest seas. When whale spirit appears, it is a reminder that there is a great mystery that you must accept without intellectually trying to understand it. Some things cannot be known by the mind, only experienced through the heart, through intuition, and through the peripheral senses that part the invisible veil separating the visible world from the great manifesting consciousness in the hidden realms. Now is the time for you to immerse yourself in the great mystery of spirit and to trust that within the invisible, what you can't see now are the seeds of your intentions being attended to by the angels. <clears throat> so great. So yes, I recently channeled a lady, uh, a letter for a lady, and um, in it it was very specific about I would love. Uh, it was a Valentine's message, and it was saying I'd love to give you a yellow rose, and uh, it was really specific that it was a yellow rose, <clears throat> which is unusual because you'd expect it to be a red rose. But anyway, it was definitely yellow. And I sent her the letter that came through. And uh, that lady came back and said that she'd had a session with somebody different, a different um, lady, who had also talked about the yellow rose. And it's things like that that just spin my head. And that that's the great mystery, isn't it? I mean, how does that happen? I have no idea. But it's the fact that we are given this information for spirit. We see it you know, um, and then yellow roses over the last few days have been everywhere. And uh, that's the thing. It's just like this miraculous mystery of how all these synchronicities work. Um, but it is quite, you know, that sort of confirmation, that double confirmation from two different readers is kind of, yeah, it's lovely. So <clears throat> the other guidance is Grandmother Earth. So stop and take measure of your life. Assess who you are and where you are. Get grounded. Make plans for the future, but don't act on those plans until you are ready and feel secure in stepping forward. There is a profound source of strength and power within you, and it is expanding now. Put your roots down. This is a time of preparation and going deeper. 
Your nature spirit wants you to know that Grandmother Earth pr provides the trees, the plants, the flowers, the rivers, the streams, the oceans, the mountains, the valleys, and supports us all with her bounty. She is stable and strong in her devotion to us. You are supported and loved, even if you're not always sure of it. Strength is growing within you. Don't rush, slow down. The seeds that you plant now will bring abundance in the future, but only if you take the time to nurture those new beginnings. Take time to plan your future carefully. Don't rush into anything. <clears throat> Security and protection surround you. You are safe. If you're thinking of making secure financial investments and receive this card, it's telling you that this is a good time to do so. It's not a time to take risks. To deepen your connection to Grandmother Earth and bring security in all forms into your life, walk barefoot on the earth. Place your hands in the earth or make investments. Imagine the strengthening, grounding energy of the earth filling you and your life. Wow. <clears throat> so I've just noticed that this is on page 57. And very sadly, somebody in the media here in the UK killed herself yesterday at the age of 40. I woke up yesterday morning at 507 um, I always get timestamps from my twin's WhatsApp to get a message, and his was also 57. When this story broke yesterday, and I've just noticed that this is 57 as well, um, the flat that this lady lived in was 57. And I have noticed that more and more and more about what is... what. Uh, so I'll see numbers, I'll see sequences, I'll hear, or it will be about the person, and then that person very shortly... Um, tra traverse, you know, traverses over to the other side, and that was so just, and it's so important to remember that people, you know, this life is really vulnerable, and to take care of yourself, you know, forty is such a young age to take your own life, and uh, nothing, you know, there is always so much support. So no matter how how bad it is just remember there's support out there all around you to help you um because i was so shocked yesterday because she was just such a young yeah it's just terrible um you know sometimes it really it sort of hits you and the fact that she's just so young and just yeah had a very strong yeah it's just well, yeah it's shocking so um but 57 is going to be the letter that I read from the Divine Love Letter books because that is the one that wants to come through. So um, 57 is um, this. It's also the number of Heinz baked beans, 57. There's another message in that because my grandmother used to sing this song. I can't sing it, but it's basically about beans. Be you probably know it. Beans, beans, the, 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 the good for your heart. The more you eat, the more you you can add in the uh, info. <laughs> so just ties in again to all of the synchronicities, messages, connections. That everything is connected. We are all so interconnected. It's unreal. So don't be sad. Don't be sad for what we haven't got. Or oh, This is so poignant given it's just been Valentine's Day. Or oh, we are not doing because we are always doing everything together. Just remember, just imagine that I'm your vis invisible friend and I'm with you everywhere you go, enjoying the same food, the same experiences. That way you will never feel alone because you know that I'm always going to be right by your side, holding your hand, taking you along this amazing journey called life. Remember to stay with me because we will be each other's love and light and life. Okay, <clears throat> so we will be, we're experiencing this together. So I want you to know that I think about you all the time. Every second of every day, it's every thought that I have always comes back around to you. I wish that you could be in my head for just one day and then you would have no doubt about our love for each other. How I feel for you is, without doubt, the most powerful feeling I have ever experienced. As sure as night follows day and day follows night, we will be together. We are together. Trust that the feelings you have for me are reciprocated, because we are two hearts coming together to build a beautiful whole. A whole that is so vast that you cannot comprehend with your mind. It is so vast it can fill a galaxy. Your love is beyond words and beyond what our eyes can see. It is the heart and the feeling of love that we are meant to be together forever. 
Okay. <clears throat> and that's that, you know, going back to the great mystery from the whale, was saying there are things that you just don't understand. That connection, that me waking up at 57, uh, the message from my twin, 57, the fact that this lit girl's flat was 57, we just landed on 57. I mean, it's just, you know, just all saying, <clears throat> keep going, basically, because there's so much that we don't understand. There's so much that we're being guided to and awoken to and waken up to. So I think about all the amazing times that we're going to have with each other, the incredible life that we're going to make together, living an incredible life, trusting in the universe to bring us magical experiences, a magical rainbow family, a magical existence where we can paint our rainbow colours on the world, to bring light and colour into each other's life. That is what I think about, what I dream about. I think about us coming together and a beautiful technical merger of our bodies in a blissful state of eternal union. <clears throat> wow. So I'm going to end with that last one because that was amazing. I think about all the amazing times that we're going to have with each other, the incredible life that we're going to make together, living an incredible life, trusting in the universe to bring us magical experiences, a magical rainbow family, a magical existence where we can paint our rainbow colours on the world, to bring light and colour into each other's life. That is what I think about, what I dream about. I think about us coming together in a beautiful technical merger of our bodies in a blissful state of eternal union. Wow, there you go. So, <clears throat> whale spirit and also, um, what was it? It was whale spirit and the native guidance was grandmother. So grandmother energy is super strong. Whale spirit is to believe in the great mystery. You are part of that great mystery. You... In fact, you're not part of it. You are the great mystery. So I hope that helps. And uh, if you want a healing, a reading, a channeled letter, um, all my details are in the link. All right. And the song today is Faded by Alan Walker. Um, because I've recently, uh, that song has been coming up quite a lot in people's healings recently. Um, it's all about Atlantis return to our roots basically our, um uncovering our ancient wisdom so i hope that helps all right take care bye